Hi, my name is Julie McCachran. I'm 24. I'm currently a student at St. Mary's University. I've been there for about three years, um, studying psychology. Um, right now I'm working at the Aspetovan Heritage Trust, the cap site there in Hubbards. It's a fantastic spot, beautiful community, nicest people. Um, yeah, just a, just a fantastic place to have a, a cap site. It's, it's central and, and uh, a lot of the community members don't have direct access, whether the internet or they don't have a computer at home. So it's definitely a key part to their community there. I really recommend a CAP intern position to other students. It's, um, it's such a, a unique opportunity and, and you learn so much from the, from the job. Um, it's something you wouldn't get from you know, any other typical university student job, that's for sure. Uh, the interactions with, with people that you're, you're teaching and that you work with are, um, you know, it's just, it's great. It's really one-on-one -on -one and, and it's nice to be able to help people. Site. Um, varies, <laughs> varies quite a bit, you know, st stemming from computer related uh, issues. Um, can range from teaching classes back to back from the minute you get there to the minute you leave. Classes can range from, you know, teaching people how to turn a computer on to uh, selling things to people on eBay or teaching them how to type, use the internet. Google is the main thing. I think I say Google about a hundred times a day now. Um, yeah, and um, and also, I think with each interim position, there's also a, a side project that goes along with it, and that's definitely a main focus too, depending on what that is. And my favorite moment so far, um, there's this really nice older couple that come in relatively frequently for classes, and uh, one day they came in, and she brought out her Anne Rawls card and her HBC reward card. I wasn't quite sure where that was going. Um, but she wanted me to, she had never checked, she didn't know how to check her points. So um, she wanted to see, you know, if they could actually afford a trip somewhere, but they weren't expecting much at all. So we, we went on and we, we transferred the HBC points over the air miles and, and uh, did all the calculations. We went on some travel sites and found the flights. And it turned out they had enough, um, enough points to, to go to Newfoundland and back to visit their, their families. That was, that was by far the best. 